Okay, this how-to video is a uh, part two of the place replicate module. Um, there is already a how-to video about the place replicate function and using that. Uh, this video is going to cover some of the additional features that Cadence have introduced for the place replicate module at version 16.6. So, so the main addition is the, the ability to support text locations. So you'll see I've obviously got the IC, all the, all the silkscreen references of NATO markers here for all the components. And what I need to do is obviously include that as part of my place replicate module. So I can move um, the text around to, to specific locations that I want to use. So we'll do that very, very quickly just to give you a rough idea. What we're going to do, uh, once we're happy with that, then we create our place replicate module as we would normally. Right mouse button snap picture to pick the origin. Now you'll see that there's actually some, some added functionality here. We can now uh, do some extra snapping locations. We're still gonna use the pin in this example and let's just give it a name. And then that creates the module. And then if we go to the, to reuse that module, we'll window select all these items. We'll apply Steve. I'm just gonna hide the form and just accept the defaults. And you'll notice that the, the, the text locations have actually been stored. So we can, we can use that as part of the replicate module. 